Hey gang, how's it going? This is Gektech here. I'm going to do a quick little tutorial on how to incorporate uh, Extra Life with your Streamlabs setup uh, so that anytime someone donates to your Extra Life page, it will pop up on, uh, on stream for you. So I'm going to make a couple assumptions here. One, you already have OBS installed. Uh, two, you are already a Streamlabs user, and three, you already are uh, registered with the Extra Life website. So let's go ahead and get started. When you load up Streamlabs, this is your dashboard, this is what you're presented with. Um, what we're going to do is add a donation widget. So that's here in the widgets section, just click on that, and then click on alert box. And once the page loads, we will be presented with our alert box settings. Um, you can set up all kinds of things, uh, alerts for follows, subscriptions, donations, hosting, bits. Uh, but we're just going to focus on donations today. So you can go ahead and set up your general settings however you like. Uh, I generally just go with the default, but it's up to you. Make sure every time you make a change to save settings, that's very important. And the part that we're going to focus on right now is donations. Now these will uh, count um, for your regular uh, channel donations, and then I'll show you in a little bit how to incorporate Extra Life with that. So again, make sure it's enabled and set up everything, how you want it to look and sound and all that fun stuff. One tip I would like to give is, uh, I believe the sound volume, <clears throat> excuse me, the default is usually 100%. I recommend dropping that down to about 30%, but you'll have to play with that a little bit uh, to see how it works best for you. Um, and again, anytime you make any changes, be sure to save your settings. Now what you're going to want to do is back at the top, there's this section, uh, click to show widget URL. I'm not going to do that because I like keeping mine private. Um, but click on that and it will display your URL. And then you want to copy that. And then we're going to go over to OBS. And in the sources section, you're going to add, <coughs> pardon me, you're going to add a browser source and give it a name. We'll call it uh, Stream Labs Alert Box or whatever you, you choose to call it. Now in this section, the, the most important part is right here, the URL. That's where you're going to paste your URL. I'm going to go ahead and paste mine so I can show you how it, uh, how it pops up. Um, but I'm going to clip this part, so I'll be right back with you. Okay, so after you paste in your uh, alert box URL that you copied from the Streamlabs website, and then click OK, this is what you're presented with. So now if you slide this over, well, you can leave it there. Um, <laughs> I'm going to go back over to the Streamlabs website. I'm going to do some fancy Alt-Tab action to get back to OBS after I push a button. So I'm going to push this test donation and then Alt-Tab back to OBS to make sure it works. There we go. So my... This is a test donation for dollar. There we go. My donation popped up, so I know it's working. One thing I like to do, but this is just personal preference, uh, if you right-click on your alert box, uh, browser source, and go to transform, and then all the way down at the bottom, center to screen, it'll just kind of put it in the middle of your stream. And I like doing that so it's the same on uh, multiple scenes and stuff like that. Just personal preference. Okay, so we have our donation uh, section set up, but our extra life information is not quite there just yet. So what you're going to need to do is go over to your extra life page. Uh, so I'm already logged in over here. This is my extra life page. Raised $59 so far. Thank you, guys. 
Uh, the information you're going to need from this page is up here in the URL for the participant ID. There's a number right at the very end. You're going to need to copy that. Copy. I already have mine in, so I won't need that. But copy that number there, and then go back over to Streamlabs. And you're going to go to this Community and Growth section. Go ahead and open that up. And then you'll see there's an Extra Life tab. So go ahead and click on that. And that number that you copied from your Extra Life page, you're going to paste it right in here to your participant ID. And you're going to make sure that you enable the alerts. And again, save settings. And that's really all there is to it. I can't, they, they don't have an Extra Life uh, test donation button available. But it pops up right along with your regular uh, donations. I'll go back over there and show it to you one more time. I don't know why the page is taking so long to load. But there we go. So we're going to test donation again. And uh, if this was in... This is a test donation for dollar. If this was a, if that was an extra life donation, it would show up exactly the same way, um, and that's really all there there is to it. You just start streaming and raise some funds for extra life. I hope that helped out. I am uh, I am Gek Tech on t the Twitch.tv service. If you have any other questions, I'd be happy to answer them for you. Uh, just go ahead and leave it down below in the comments, and yeah, I'll see you next time. Thank you everybody for watching.